Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Kimberly Wilcox if you've never seen my face before. Today we have probably one of the biggest homeware haul ever. I am just so shocked at how much I've been buying. I am moving out in two weeks so I've slowly been accumulating things to purchase instead of waiting until I move in the apartment and then going shopping. I've been pretty much shopping on my lunch breaks or on the weekends and I've just been buying little things so I feel like my bank account doesn't hit it as much but I think this is the worst thing because I'm spending a hundred bucks here, a hundred bucks there, three hundred bucks there, three hundred bucks there and I look at all this stuff and I've at least spent two grand worth of kind of home decor for my house. So this will include Kmart, Target, Spotlight, Adairs, random homeware stores. I just have a lot of stuff basically so let's get into it. I think I'm gonna go buy shops. I might start off with my Kmart stuff because everyone loves Kmart. Everyone knows how affordable Kmart is and how good their homewares is. So we got a lot of organizing things. I actually have in my bathroom a four mirror storage unit. So I'm so excited about organizing that, having my skincare on display. I got myself some tubs. These are just the clear draw small tubs and I can put my makeup items in these. I got four. I've already got a ton in my makeup setup. So if I need to purchase more, I can do that. But I didn't want to go over the top knowing that I already have so many to begin with. Oh, I actually got five. <laughs> There's another one. That makes sense. I definitely probably would have gotten at an even number. And if I don't use all these in my bathroom, I can use my bedside tables in my kitchen. And then I got a medium one of that one. I think these are going to be for my hair products, hair tools, everything like that. And then I got a large one. I only got one of each because I don't know if I'm going to use the smaller ones or if I want to use the bigger ones. So I started off just grabbing one of those each so I can see if they fit because I also don't know if there's like a wall. I've never seen my apartment before by the way. <laughs> never seen it. So everything that I'm going off is what I have seen from videos or photos. Um, I already have these ones for my pantry. I already have tons of sets but I wanted to pick up another one because I only had two of these. I know that I'll definitely need three of them for my cereal, probably for my oats. And then I picked up a pink silicon muffin tray. I also picked up the loaf one but I used it last night but that was really good for banana bread but anything pink I pretty much pick up because I'm obsessed with pink and these are really good because you don't have to use those liners and I can make like banana muffins in them I honestly just have stuff everywhere <laughs> I also got a little glass travel harp I already have this one but I've lost the lid and I don't know where this is <laughs> so I got one of these because I'll be catching the train so I'm gonna keep this as is I picked up a to-do list notepad I always buy stuff stationary every single time I go to Kmart and I also picked up to fold your t-shirts like really straight it's pretty cool it was like six dollars I love organizing my clothes <laughs> so I actually gave this a go not long ago when I was folding my t-shirts and put them away I picked up a grocery I haven't seen this color before it's probably been around for ages but I picked that one up so we can put that on the fridge for weekly <laughs> grocery list I picked up the book the power of now I've been wanting to read this for ages and they've redesigned the book cover and it is so ecstatic like I am gonna put this on my bookshelf now it's like a nice beige color with gold and I'm actually excited to read that I can put that on my bedside table and know that it looks pretty you know I picked up two cotton pillowcases 400 thread count these are just for my spare pillows I picked up some combs for my middle part kind of. I picked up some glass coffee mugs, just a four pack. And I'm trying to go as quick as possible because I just know how much stuff I have. I got a bread bin. Guys, I went to like five Kmarts and none of them had them. <laughs> and when I saw it um, at the Kmart near my work the other day, I was like, if I don't pick it up now, I probably won't see it in a month's time. So I picked it up and then I picked up the special coffee tea and sugar little canisters they'll look really nice on our kitchen bench everything goes and matches so I'm excited to have those on display I love 
I love the font of these ones. For my bathroom, I picked up these stone marble soap canister, one for my toothbrush, and I picked up the matching tray. So they can go on my bathroom counter or pretty. I'm obsessed with white, if you don't know this already. White and pink, anything kind of basic clean. That is my style. I picked up this display tray. I'm not too sure what I'm going to use it for. Maybe my skincare or jewelry, perfume bottles. But again, really nice. It was quite affordable. It was $10 and it's decently sized. It's like almost two heads basically. It's not too heavy. I have the marble one and it is too, too heavy. And I think this is the last thing from Kmart. I definitely have picked up other stuff, but I don't know where they all are. I picked myself up just like a cheap electric blanket. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like my electric blankets only last a year or two. So I'm done buying expensive ones. Like last time I bought, like it was like $200 and it lasted like a year. My half of the bed continued working. So I kept it. And then the left half of the bed stopped working and after a year and then I was like I can't even return this it's not even under warranty so I threw that out because I was like what's the point in keeping a half electric blanket so I picked up another one for my bed I think this was about $50 quite affordable I mean if I get a winter out of it or two I'll be happy I picked up a quilt cover this isn't my main quilt cover but I'm gonna leave this at my mum and dad's I've previously had this there was a pen inside of it when I put it in the wash about a month ago and the pen leaked and went through the old one so I'm gonna throw that out yeah that's everything from Kmart not bad right <laughs> next I'm gonna actually go in with the Adair stuff so I picked up this Reed Fuser I thought I picked up a different one and when I opened it I was like oh it's a naked lady wow <laughs> but I mean it's quite aesthetic because it's all white but that's what it looks like little booty <laughs> but I thought this would be really good to just have in my house as a decorative item Item, or even in my bathroom they give you quite a big refillable bottle so I'm gonna pop that in but it's still quite aesthetic even if it's a half naked woman <laughs> picked up another white duna cover this is honestly just like plain cotton a basic really it's quite like soft and it's just like a basic to have I probably didn't need to purchase it but that's okay and I realized I got it in a queen that's so weird of me right because I have a queen bed and I always buy everything in a king I'm gonna have to go back and change that to a king. Picked up like just a fitted sheet in the jersey material. This will be good for winter. And I got it in like a sage color. I also picked up the pillowcases to match, but I had to purchase them online. So they're still on their way to me. <laughs> And then I picked up towels. So I picked up four of the normal ones. Like they're quite big. I was going to get the bed sheet ones. But when I saw these, I was like, oh my God, they're big enough. I practice if they wrapped around my body and they do. And they're very soft and they're like a eucalyptus. Picked up four of those. And then I got two pan towels. We love that. We love a little hook. That is like the best feature. I have those um, on a few of my other towels and it's just so easy easy to like hang up. Do the towels have it? Do the towels have it? Please tell me uh, my day is about to be made. I don't think they are. No, they don't. I just knew I would have noticed something like that. How annoying. <laughs> I find the hook is really good if you have like one of those over the door hook. You can just hang up your towel on there after you've dried yourself so it can air off. <laughs> And then I actually just picked up a three pack of the face washers. I think these will be for decoration. I don't think I'll be using these to wipe off my face or maybe just use them as like a hand towel or yeah, wiping my clean face, but definitely not my makeup because I don't want to stain them. They also have, what a shame the towels didn't have. But I really like that set. It's the Archie one in eucalyptus and it's quite the quality is there. They were 40 bucks a towel maybe, not too sure. All I know is I spent $600 at Adair's and then I did a big online order and that got shipped to me so we spent a lot of money at it is a lot I reckon almost 800 to a gram I picked up this quilt cover and I didn't know that it doesn't come with like your normal pillowcases I didn't read it I just got it and I was like okay it'll come with one set of a standard pillowcase to match 
and it didn't, so I had to go back in and buy it. Um, so I picked this one up in a King. It is so cuddly. I love it, and I am really excited about using this as my new everyday quilt. Like, I am most excited about putting this on. I was like, maybe I should put it on, like, when I'm at my mom and dad's, and I was like, no, it's white. It'll get dirty. Keep it in the sleeve so when I move, everything is like still pretty much new, right? I picked up two European pillowcases. I'll link everything in the description box. So I picked two of them up. Standard one that I have to go back in and buy. The standard pillowcases. So I have a set. I just got one because I'll put white behind it. I don't want it to be too overwhelming and I think I'll have these and then just the plain white pillows that I got for behind it and I'll probably sleep on the plain white ones because I'm just like so scared to sleep on these and and then I can always add like some cushions or like different color normal pillows to add texture to that. I also have a green throw that will match with like my eucalyptus sage green color in my room. That's everything from Adair. And then I ducked into Pillow Talk. I only got a couple items. Firstly, I got this like over the shower caddy because a few of the apartments we were looking at, the glass goes to the ceiling. It'll come in silver or black. So when I saw a white one, we picked it up. But this will just go over my shower nozzle. <laughs> if not, I already have a white one that I got from Kmart that I'll use. But yeah, we'll see how it all works. I don't know if my shampoo and conditioner will fit on here, only up here and then my body wash. It will do the job for now. <laughs> I picked up two tea towels. These are micro fiber ones and they're quite a nice bone color. We have palm leaves. Then we have a little bit of a texture one and then just like a plain stone bone kind of color. They'll be very useful. That is everything that I picked up from Pillow Talk. Let's move on to Target. I just have stuff from everywhere and I'm sorry about it. That's why I made like a really big collective haul today. I... Okay, let's talk about this little basket. I love that it's white. Like it's going to be perfect for my bathroom to put my dirty clothes in. It was $25 from Target, I believe. But it's a perfect size because I won't let it build up too much with my dirty clothes. And it's like a good weekly basket, basically. I picked up two water jugs, like for water, cordial, coffee. They're a necessity, basically. <laughs> And then I picked up two of these. I don't know where the other one is. I think it's somewhere. But I thought I could just make my own like room spray with essential oils. So that's what I picked up. I don't know if I picked up anything else from Target. I didn't. Target wasn't providing the goods. Let's quickly do Big W. I picked up clip for like my undies. My indoor clothes line. I picked up a pink sheet set. This is for kind of summer. This is the annoying thing. I've purchased like so many things that I forget what I've even got. But at least I have two sheet sets. So when one's in the wash, there's a backup. And this is like quite light linen. So this will be good for summer. I picked up a hand wash. I know random, but they were on sale. And I was like, I'll get them now. Cucumber green tea scent. I like that scent. It's like quite refreshing. And then I picked up the beauty bar in the same scent. And then I just picked up a sensitive body bar. So two packs of soap, which I probably didn't need, but they were on sale. And I was like, let's just stock up for the year. I think that's everything from BW. I'm getting through this a lot quicker than I expected. Yeah. Let's go with Spotlight. Spotlight had a few goods that I never would have thought to go in there for homewares. Anyway, I was at a home maker center. They had a spotlight and I was like, let's just have a browse for sheets. Didn't buy sheets, bought bathroom accessories. First thing, we can see it. <laughs> I can hold it down. Is this stool that I picked up. It was, I think, $35. But I'm going to put this in my bathroom. And I'm going to put a plant on top of it. I love the texture, the colour. I feel like you don't see these stools around enough. And I'm really excited to style that in my bathroom. That was definitely one of my favourite items that I found. The next thing is this white bamboo mat for the shower. I have a wood one at my parents' house and I love it. It's so marked. But this was the first time I had ever seen a white one and I was like, you're coming home with me. <laughs> um, so I picked that one up for my shower. Like this over a bath mat from the shower because I feel like the bath mats slip 
get really wet and I just I like having that. I feel like I need to justify myself on all my crazy spendings basically. And then I picked up a bath mat. This will go in front of my bath sink like my vanity. It's just in a white pattern. I know everyone's gonna be like why did you buy white? And I'm gonna be like I bought white because I can just bleach it and it matches the toilet one because I feel like you never see the toilet contour one and the bath mat match like they're all in that like gray color and I just I wasn't vibing so when I saw that they match and they were exactly the same I picked them up even if they last a year I'll upgrade in a year's time because everyone's gonna be like they're not gonna last long with it being white but we know I love white so it's just a given the next thing I picked up were three I thought I picked up four I must have only got three little face washes these were on sale for two dollars lovely color and I feel like I won't be as scared to use these on my face but really nice I wish they had other towels to match it because I actually really like the tassel effect at the end. But they only had the face washes left in stock, which is a little bit upsetting. But that's okay. $2 each, a bargain. And I think you can't have too many face washes because I use them all the time and they're quite aesthetic. They might match. Oh yeah, I can layer them, which is cool. So I picked those up. I think that's almost everything. Got one more thing. Random Audi find is an <laughs> egg color tray for my fridge. This has 14 eggs, which I find bizarre, but it makes sense if you get like a pack of 12 when you're almost out, you still have a spot for two of them, but quite ecstatic. I love that it has a lid because a lot of them didn't have lids and a lot of them were like 30 40 dollars and I think this was 10 bucks from Audi they didn't have any other fridge organizing systems left which is kind of annoying so when I do move out I'm gonna purchase a lot of the fridge organizing systems because I love clear things you can see what's in them and then things don't get hidden and, <laughs> and missing so I'll have to do a video with my, my fridge organization so stay tuned for that but it seems like I've got through everything that I have purchased over the past month or two I hope you guys did enjoy this haul please stay tuned because I'll be making so many more moving vlogs and you'll be able to see all of these items in action in my new house so I hope you guys do hit that subscribe button if you already haven't already give this video a thumbs up and enjoy the rest of your day bye Thanks for watching.